The round goby, an invasive species. What is the round goby? The round goby is a fish that is around 16 centimeters long and looks a lot like many other species of fish. It is covered in scales and is brown in color with dark olive spots. It is found in the Great Lakes, mainly in areas where it is rocky and sandy. Along with the Great Lakes, it is also found in Eastern Europe, where it came from. The round goby eats insects and other small organisms. These fish compete with many other species of its own size. Why is the round goby an invasive species? The round goby came to the Great Lakes in 1990. The reason why the round goby is considered an invasive species is because it has a negative impact on the Great Lakes ecosystem. Another reason why the round goby is considered an invasive species is because it has no natural predators. Humans also do not eat this fish, the reason being that it is not visually appealing and does not taste too good. How did the round goby come to Canada and become invasive? This fish is native to the Black and Caspian Seas in Eastern Europe. It was first found in North America in 1990 in the St. Clair River north of Windsor, Ontario. Researchers believe the fish was brought to North America in the water of ships from Europe. In less than a decade, the round goby has successfully spread through all five Great Lakes and has begun to invade waters. In some areas, the fish has reached densities of more than 100 fish per square meter. Since the fish has no natural predators, it just keeps growing in population. The dangers and negative effects of the round goby. The fish has many negative effects which cause it to be a danger to our environment and the Great Lakes. It poses many threats towards the ecosystem and needs to be stopped. The round goby competes with many low living fish such as sculpin and log perch. The, this threatens several species in the Great Lakes. Round goby also have reduced populations of sport fish by eating their eggs and competing with them for food sources. The round goby is really competitive and takes over all the land it can obtain, posing a threat to many other organisms. Researchers believe that the round goby is linked to outbreaks of brutalism type E and disease, a disease found in the Great Lakes. This disease affects many fish and fish-eating birds, causing them to die off. How can people like us control the round goby? The round goby is harming native fish by taking over their communities and feeding on eggs of native fish. In addition, the round goby is a threat to wildlife in the Great Lakes food webs, impacting life at higher trophic levels of the food chain and spreading diseases. These are the exact reasons why we should care and try to stop these fish from expanding. Some things we can do to prevent this are Never buy or use round goby as bait or have it in your possession. Learn how to identify these fish and if you see them, immediately contact the invasive species hotline. Wash your boat and all boating equipment prior to leaving any water body. And never dump waste bait back into your water bodies after fishing. Hopefully, after watching this PSA, you understand the threat that round goby poses to the Great Lakes ecosystem and why you should care.